Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 27 of the Adobe XD tutorial series and today we're going to uh, talk about how to group and ungroup objects inside of Adobe XD. So uh, to group objects what you need to do is simply may, you may have different level of objects like this and these are all individually uh, you can move it. So now if you want to make this whole what you can simply do is you can click and drag the mouse just like this and then right click and then say group. All right, so now this is a single object. And now if I want it back, what I can also do is I can ungroup it, ungroup it. So I can just right click and then say ungroup and you can see that it goes back to the four original shapes. I can also make subgroups over here. So what I can do is I can select all of these and I can group this. And in the layer, you can see that there's a group. You can double click on it and you can see that the folder actually opens. So I can select two uh, more uh, shapes just like this. I can right click and then group them out again. So now a subgroup is formed. Over here in the subgroup, you can also double click again and you can create another subgroup just like that. So just select this, right click and group. And you can see that the subgroup has been formed just like that. So you can see a hierarchy of the group just like that. If you were to click backside, so all of these groups now uh, belong together and these have the subgroups. So if I were to ungroup it, so right click and ungroup it, you can see that the top folder will only ungroup. So the subgroups are still there. So if I want to ungroup it again, I'm just going to select the subgroup and ungroup that out. And then the sub subgroup will be out and I'm going to ungroup that as well. And that is how you group and ungroup object inside of Adobe XD. Another cool thing about Adobe XD is that uh, you can group and ungroup the regular objects. You can also ungroup the repeat grid uh, options over here. So let's say, for example, you have this right now. So I have these individual grids right now. So what I can actually also do is I can right click and ungroup the grid. And once I ungroup the grid, what happens is that you can see all of the objects now act individually. So you can use the repeat grid tool to actually create multiple instances of a similar object and you can ungroup it and you can see the results. So this can be used to create a very quick design for your user interface. So that is how grouping and ungrouping works inside of Adobe XD. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.